Billionaire says Donald Trump called him saying, I just bombed Iraq. What to know? In a new episode of 60 Minutes Australia, Pratt, who is the chairman of Bizey Industries, said Trump shared sensitive information with several people outside of the White House in late 2019. Time equals 400 ms, greater than, he's got this ability to say outrageous things nonstop, Pratt said in a recording obtained by 60 Minutes. He just says whatever the f asterisk 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 he wants and he loves to shock people. Pratt and Trump developed a relationship during Trump's presidency. Pratt was a supporter of the former president and a member of the mar a lago Club. It's not clear who Pratt was talking to in the recordings shared by 60 Minutes or at what time they took place, but Pratt divulged shocking information about Trump's willingness to brag at all costs. Time equals 400 ms, greater than, it hadn't even been on the news yet and he said, I just bombed a rock today, Pratt said. The Australian billionaire recalled Trump going on to tell him that the president of Iraq called him and said, you just leveled my city. To which Trump responded, okay, what are you going to do about it? Time equals 400 ms, greater than check this out. Donald Trump's 2024 presidential ambitions face serious threat from Colorado case than criminal trials, says former attorney Trump's former national security advisor John Bolton told 60 Minutes that he wasn't surprised when he heard the recordings. Trump was probably trying to impress Pratt and show him that he knows things that he doesn't, Bolton said. I do think that's very typical Trump behavior. Bolton noted that military strike announcements are often delayed to protect those carrying out the orders and suggested that if Trump shared sensitive information prematurely, it could have jeopardized the safety of military personnel. Trump doesn't have a filter between his brain and his mouth, Bolton said. Federal prosecutors recently interviewed Pratt regarding investigations into how Trump handled classified documents. Pratt said Trump also shared sensitive information about U.S. nuclear submarines, but defended his intentions, saying the former president was attempting to show how he was advocating for Australia in the U.S. He insisted that Trump did not share classified documents. He knows exactly what to say and what not to say so that he avoids jail, but gets so close to it that it looks to everyone like he's breaking the law, Pratt said in the 60 Minutes recordings.